Hello everybody, welcome back to another video, and this one, I'm going to do two things that I never thought I'd do in my entire life on purpose. I went to Bing.com <laughs> on purpose, and I even downloaded Microsoft Edge, that's right, and not just any Microsoft Edge, I downloaded Microsoft Edge for Mac on purpose. Yeah, it's a weird day, how's my life going, ask me. Yeah, how's my life going? It's going pretty good. Okay, anyways, let's get out the jokes. Here we go, guys. Why am I doing that? Why would I ever go here and do these things simple? ChatGPT, uh, OpenAI is coming to search, and in particular, it's coming to Microsoft Bing. They have begun the integration of it, and it has gone live, sort of. <laughs> There's a little bit of integration issues. They haven't completely launched it yet, but they have a, a teaser, so to speak, and there's also a group of people that have limit that have full access i'm just not one of them because well i don't know because i'm a nobody but one day we'll see anyways go to bing.com and you'll see a few things in particular you're going to see this one you're going to see ask me anything up here but here's the one this is where basically you can it's integrated in chat gpt and it's got it sort of set up so that you can run a few basic prompts like this but you can't really start typing in your own crazy stuff yet so i'm just going to go ahead and see what we got here so um, okay, here we go. I am planning a trip for my university. No, I'm looking to throw a dinner party. No, plan, plan me a workout for my arms and abs with no sit-ups and no gym equipment. Oh, yeah, this will be really effective. Uh, yeah, it's at, uh, <laughs> Planet, what is that? Planet Fitness? No, um, Anytime Fitness or No Time Fitness. Anyways, let's try it, see what happens. Okay, standard stuff here, but look on the right side. Eh, 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 here we go. It is loading up ChatGPT, and it is doing its thing. This is the new part and if you click on the show more, you'll see here that it's basically taking the chat GPT interface and typing it out sort of similar to what you'd get if you went right into chat GPT. So this is the new part here. Uh, there's a few other things happening with uh, this program. Let me just make sure I have this all correct here. Um, it's basically a new AI powered homepage and it's going to have the expanded chat box as you saw earlier. And it can just basically ask, you can ask it anything including more than just facts-based questions. Fact-based questions, come on, Curtis, use your words. So apparently Bing can do things like answer questions with context, similar to the way ChatGPT does. You can do things like create itineraries for trips, and then you can ask it to go further and plan a five-day trip to Mexico, for example. And uh, yeah, you can ask it additional questions based on your previous questions. Keep in mind, ChatGPT sort of uses a conversation model, so... How do I get to Mexico? Five day trip. What would be my itinerary? And then you can ask it more like how much would it cost? Can I change things in it? It's all coming to Microsoft Bing. And uh, yeah, it's already here in a limited in a limited manner, just like you can see here. And uh, yeah, uh, people are going to start using Bing now on purpose. So that's just the video. Thanks for watching. As soon as more stuff comes out, I will make it available. Thanks for watching.